Working with the mount fields in Business Central. When you work with the mount fields on journals and documents, you type in amounts in the same field, regardless if the amount is a debit or credit amount. You use a sign in front of the amount to determine if the amount is debit or credit, depending on the scenario. And by default, an amount and amount and local currency field is shown. If you're more comfortable working with the debit and credit amount specifically, maybe you think it gives a better overview, you can change the setting to reveal these two fields and their local currency counterparts. This is done at the General Ledger Setup page. Let's go there. I bring up the Tell Me Search with LQ. I type General Ledger Setup and I select the search result. To find the field I'm looking for, I want to expand to see the full list of fields on the General Fast tab. So I click the Show More link on the right side. I browse down to find the Show Amounts field. Here I can select different options. In my case, I'd like to work with the debit and credit fields, so I select debit and credit only. Now, when I go to, for example, the general journal, let's go there, and I browse out to the right and find my amount fields. Now I find that the debit amount and credit amount field has been revealed here. In my case, I like this because it gives me an overview of when things balance and they don't. This is up to your preference, but notice that when you change this setting, it applies company-wide and not only for the current user. It applies for all users. This way, you can determine which kind of amount fields to work with. Thank you for watching.